Gottlieb batter up is lit up for the first time in a long time and also has brand new rubber on the game. Um, these are all Comet LEDs. They are the Retro SMD bullets. Um, some of these lights are not lit up right now because they are controlled lights. That means you have to accomplish certain things for them to light up, like third, second, and first. This one for a 1,000 points on both sides, and then the 500 points on both sides. And then the pop bumpers, they light up while the game's on. And also three, one, and two. Those are all controlled lights. Um, these also will turn on with the pop bumpers, I believe. These light up the skirt. There's instruction cards in the skirt. And that's the little tower for the um, credit light. But that's kind of a useless thing since this game is on free play. We did get the very targets all rebuilt. And where's the release? There we go. It wouldn't do that before. Um, they were just stuck. But um, pop bumpers are all cleaned up. I mean, the top of this play field is just beautiful. You can see the reflection of the four um, lights that are up there in a play field. That's how nicely it polished up. But yeah, it's beautiful. Just don't, don't look at this area. Um, like I said before, something had nested here at one time. It had to have because this is just destroyed to finish. Nothing I can do about it unless I um, take it and clear coat it. But um, that would royally exceed the value of this machine. The only thing that can be done is just um, kept up a good um, paste wax here. And that'd be about it. But I had to replace these two light sockets and one of these I had to replace because they were just um, bad, the lights would flicker every time, you know. I always do a bulb test like this. If that bulb turns on and off anytime I do that, then I gotta replace the socket. And then these were all working good, except for this one was just dim. It was lit up and dim, so I um, these are all, con connected by um, two bars. There's a metal plate that the sockets all go in, and then that is connected to one wire, and then all these are daisy-chained by a, a one wire for the negative or positive probe on a bulb. And so what I did is I, from the middle of the socket, which I have here, oh, I just unplugged it. From the middle of the socket, as you can see, these were once fixed before I fixed these because they were spinners. Let's do it like this. See the blob of solder there? Um, they were all in this big bar. These, this is the individual one. But anyways, I, what I did was there's a wire that comes onto this and it is also connected to this middle piece. So I just soldered a and then there was a braided wire that went to all four of the bulbs here. And what I did was, where that braided wire was, I just put a jumper wire. Where See how it's like yellow right here? That's actually corrosion along with some rust. I put a jumper from here to here. And what that does, it stabilizes the center of the bulb connection. And that glob of solder right there, where my thumb is, that stabilizes the outer body connection. So when I did that, that gave this one a better connection and lit it up all the way. So let's plug that back in. There. So lit that one. This one was just so dim. But um, yeah, all the GI that are lit up right now are Comet Retro. SMDs bullet bulbs and then all these ones that are not lit are Comet um there it goes K 
Comet NG, that means non-ghosting. These are all um, warm white, non-ghosting. So then that will light up 1,000 point is reached. Um, I have the parts for the ball trough in my little vibrating machine. However, that is too noisy to be making a video. So um, that'd be the last stuff. I got to clean up the lower apron and the upper apron. I have to clean those up. And then once those are cleaned, um, then I can take the machine and stick it in there and see what it does. But this all, everything on here seems to be working perfectly. We just have to get this through the Jones plugs here to interact with the machine flawlessly too. So I'll put a link in the description if you want to see more of this machine. Um, please subscribe, give me a thumbs up, drop a comment, something cool like that. Take care and later, focus thumb.